Hello ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls of George Gwinnett College, this is the Grizzly Talk Podcast, Thursday's episode with your host Kennedy Patterson, welcome back to this podcast show here today, and as always, we are live recording from the Grizzly Digital Network, room over at the GGC Athletics Department, huge thanks to GGC Athletics for again letting us record here in their awesome media room to record our uh, Thursday episode of the Grizzly Talk podcast. Hopefully you guys are having a fantastic, fantastic week. It is Thursday. It's wrapping up to be closer to Friday, and then the weekend is here. Let me tell you a little bit about GGC Athletics and what they got going on real quick uh, as they allow us to record here in the GDN room at GGC Athletics. Of course, the first game, ladies and gentlemen, uh, I wanted to kind of give the hype up for the first game because they're starting their season. Of course, January 30th, that's when the men's baseball will be traveling to Lakeland, Florida to go uh, play against the SEU. Ladies and gentlemen, uh, you guys can check them out. Uh, you can watch live coverage from the GGC Athletics website. All you have to do is go to ggcathletics.com and then you can select sports. And then it shows you all six of the sports. You click the sports that you want to watch. Now, baseball, softball, and tennis will be up to date. Uh, of course, you have soccer, but, I mean, they don't have too much going on. They don't have games because it's not their season yet. But you have that baseball and softball uh, season along with tennis. So you guys can really keep up with them and see their next game. And down to our ladies, the softball division. We're going to pull up their schedule for sure. You guys can go to their website again. They're going to start their season Their season, they're going to be starting it February 14th. So it's really cool that they're starting their season on Valentine's Day. They're going to be a home game. They're going to be here at the Grizzly Softball Complex February 14th. You guys are going to hear it. We're going to be streaming it. We're going to be talking about it so much up until the day of February 14th for the GGC Softball's first game and down to men's tennis. Let's take a look at their schedule real quick, of course. As we get their schedule up, they have... uh, Quite a few things coming up. You have uh, January 31st. They're going to Greenwood, South Carolina to play against the Lander. uh, I want to say Lander Tigers maybe in South Carolina. And down to our women's tennis team. A little shout out to them as well as we get their schedule pulled up. They will also be traveling to uh, Lander, South Carolina, uh, Greenwood, South Carolina for their game. So please be sure to follow all of our spring sports for this season. Now, let's get on to the fun and excitement stuff here today. Ladies and gentlemen, I got this email in my email today. And by the time you're hearing this podcast, it'll be a little bit later today. But yours truly will be going to the Grizzlies On Air radio station committee. And it's going to be Friday is when we're going to be planning up for the GGC's official radio station. Now, ladies and gentlemen, we've talked about this so many times before. And I'm very, very excited for this. GGC Grizzlies On Air radio station will be happening. We're going to be kickstarting it back in March. Okay, so stay tuned for March for the official launch date. But we have so many great plans for the uh, Grizzlies on their radio station. We have so many plans up for a lot of things to go up with this radio station. And for all of you GGC students, and I'm talking to every GGC student, every GGC, uh, every GGC community, and even RSO. If you would like to be on the Grizzlies on Air radio station, if you'd like to have your own show, all you have to do is contact us. You can contact us direct message at our Instagram at grizzly underscore talk. Or you can also send me an email. That's kpatterson2 at ggc.edu. Again, that's kpatterson2 at ggc.edu. So you guys can really uh, be a part of this family. Uh, This is something very, very new that's going to happen. And I just cannot wait for the growth of this radio station. I do truly believe that this is going to be something uh, very special for GGC as a whole. And it's kind of the the game changer, if you will. We're, We're switching it up just a little bit. Um, so we do have some more news announcements here. They're extending the date to January 31st, 2020. SGA applications, uh, the SGA 2020 elections voting will be extended to January 31st. So uh, you, a lot of students probably are wondering, hey, is it too late? It's never too late. That You have two days left uh, potentially to uh, vote on the SGA board. Of course, if you haven't heard of our podcast with SGA, go to the podcast. 
streaming on Spotify, Pandora, Our Heart Radio, iTunes. It's everywhere. We talked about they're rebuilding the coach for SGA. I was able to interview three senators for SGA, and it just really was an amazing time. So really hear their change for GGC and to really interview them is, is something very special, and I cannot wait to see the growth of that. So again, the January 31st, that's when the, uh, they extended the registration voting date. So it's really amazing for sure. Another shout-out here, GGC Scrubs, of course. Sydney, if you're listening to our podcast, you know, we like to plug you in as much as we can because we really do love what you're doing here for the GGC community. GGC Scrubs, they have their schedule out this semester. GGC Scrubs event, spring 2020, uh, February 4th, they're going to be having a welcome meeting. So again, if you guys want to be a part of that, the welcome meeting is coming up. It's a very, very exciting time. Uh, February 18th, uh, the nursing uh, session, nursing session is going to be February 18th. March 17th will be St. Patrick's uh, Biology Mixer. That sounds like a really fun event. Maybe we can get a podcast on that event. Maybe we can be up there for the St. Patty's uh, Biology Mixer to see what's going on there. And then March 31st, they're going to be having the graduate school panel. Uh, March 31st, their graduate school panel. And, of course, April 14th, officer elections and, of course, graduation. So there will be pizza for this Tuesday's uh, or this Tuesday's meeting, uh, room H20, I'm sorry, H1244. Well, they'll see you guys there. So, again, if you're in the... Uh, if you're in the nursing field or you're in the uh, nursing school there here at GGC, I really recommend you guys uh, being a part of GGC Scrubs. It really is a great organization. I was able to get uh, Sydney on the podcast before. This was last fall we did it. And, you know, she really talked about networking. She really talked about the things she wanted to achieve here at GGC in parts of GGC Scrubs. So it's just really amazing time to see that happen. And I just cannot wait to, to see the more growth of that, to see more things that they got going on. And another announcement, this was on the GGC's official Instagram page. They say, come join us in the A lobby to learn about different college health related topics. They will play a trivia and you will have the opportunity to win a prize. Of course, they had it today, 11 to 1 p.m. And I did see it on their Instagram. They really, it looked like they had a really, really awesome time from the wellness program. Uh, they presented the Grizzly Health tabling uh it's every thursday 11 to 1 30 p.m so it's not really uh, a grace period most students probably have class around that time but again it's every thursday 11 a.m to 1 p.m in the a building lobby so it just really really was a fun and exciting time i actually did see them do their thing on my way to class i, I wish i would have stopped by and really had a conversation but uh, I was not able to do that because, of course, I had class going on that day, um, well, today. So it just uh, seemed like a very, very fun and exciting time for sure. And, of course, this another news announcement is coming from the GGC uh, Involvement Center. Now, this is something very, very revolutionary. I really do like it when departments really come out to the GGC students and they really want to educate and to really inform our GGC students of many, many things that's got uh, that's going on here at GGC. Of course, the Student Center, Get Involvement Center, uh, the Diversity and Inclusion Ambassadors, and Grizzly uh, Grizzly Serve presents the Civil Rights History Tour. Again, it's going to be February 8th, 2020, of course, this year. February 8th at 9 a.m. Of course, the Civil Rights History Tour, well, they're going to be talking about freedom, peace, hope, dignity, and equality. So it's a really, really fun uh, event. It really is an amazing time to really get to know, um, the, you know, the history of uh, black history. Of course, they would like to invite all GGC, GGC students to attend the tour at the National Center of Civil and Human Rights. This event will kick off Black History Month, as you guys might be aware that, you know, not only February is used for Valentine's Day, but of course, February is used for Black History Month. And I can't wait. Um, just a little tidbit for you guys. GTP might have a little something special planning up for Black History Month. So you guys stay tuned for that as well. Uh, the trip registration includes the travel to the National Center of Civil Rights and uh, Silver, uh, Civil and Human Rights <laughs> uh, entry uh, into the museum and lunch. Again, ladies and gentlemen, another opportunity to really be a part and get involved to your school community. Of course, the registration includes the travel to the center, the entry to the museum, and also lunch is provided. So 
take advantage of this. If you have nothing going on on February 8th at 9 a.m., really get up and just really join this event. Really join them on this trip. Um, there's a one-of-a-kind trip where, of course, you get the whole thing kind of free. You know, travel to the museum and to the center, and lunch is included. Uh, follow the link. Uh, they're going to have it in the email. Of course, you have to click it. Um, the spots are filling up, ladies and gentlemen. So if you have not registered for this trip, go ahead and do it now. While you're listening to me, go to your email, click the link, and um, follow the prompts. That way you guys can go on this trip. Spots are limited because they have buses, and those buses will fill up. You know, a little tip for you guys, ladies and gentlemen of Georgia Gwinnett, the GGC community. I went to many trips, part of getting involved, and spots really do fill up. They fill up fast. So, again, if you want to take a part of this trip, please do it. You know, you're not going to regret it. You're going to really have a fun time, and it's just going to be a very, very uh, awesome time. And I really recommend uh, a lot of people going out and doing their thing for sure. Of course, this next shout out kind of goes to, of course, the GGC community as well. Um, an email was sent from Julie Jager. If I pronounce your last name wrong, I'm terribly sorry. But they had the Majors and Minors Fair. It provides an opportunity for students to engage with faculty to explore the GGC academic programs and how they relate to the future careers. Now, this is one fair that I hate to say that I missed because within this season, this spring season of Grizzly Talk Podcast, I was able to do um, many, many one-hour spectaculars. I've done the Winter Wonderland uh uh, get involved in fair and we also did the SBA Expo fair we did a one hour spectacular this one event I just had to miss because the time did not match up with me for my time but what I had to do with other things but the academic majors and minors fair um, uh, they had a hashtag too as I'm looking at it the flyer it says hashtag bring 2020 into focus I like that hashtag that is a really really awesome hashtag uh, of course they had it uh, January 28th of course, today is the 30th, so we, of course, you would have missed it. But January 28th is when I had it, 1 to 3 in the Elvis Center Building A. Um, I did see their Instagram. I saw many, many uh, RSO's Instagram about the majors and minors fair, and it looked amazing. They, you had a lot of students come out. And what's so special about that event from my you know, articulation, I think that many students came out this to, to this event because you'd be surprised there are a lot of students... Not, I wouldn't say so much students here at GGC, but there is a lot of students here at GGC where they're an undecided major, uh, particularly freshmen and sophomore. Um, don't be discouraged about that if you're listening to the podcast, if you are a freshman and, and sophomore in, in GGC, because when I was a freshman and sophomore in GGC, I was an undeclared major. I didn't know what I wanted to do. I, I wanted to find a purpose, but I didn't know about it yet. So um, don't. Do that. I wouldn't suggest people getting discouraged about that, but... This was a good fair for students who might not know what they want to do. They might not know what kind of uh, uh, major or minor they want to accommodate with. So they went to this fair and they really found out the different majors and what what they wanted to do. So I really applaud GGC in this aspect because it really shows that uh, GGC is committed for their students to uh, come out and, and, and declare major and figure out what they want to do after post-graduation. So it really is amazing. And a lot of my friends that went to an event, they say, hey, this is really good, but I think I'm going to go and get my master's in this. So it just really was an amazing time for sure. And I am very proud of GGC for that event because, you know, it's helping students figure out what they want to do within their majors for sure. So that's going to wrap it up here for the Grizzly Talk podcast. If you have not done it yet, I really recommend you guys go into our Instagram. Go to our Instagram. It's grizzly underscore talk. Again, that's grizzly underscore talk. Grizzly Talk Podcast official podcast Instagram. And if you are not subscribed to any of our uh, media platforms such as Spotify, Our Heart Radio, Pandora, iTunes, so much more. What are you waiting for? All you have to do is hit that subscribe button for all of our platforms and to be sure to do their thing there. And also, before we go, a little bit of a sponsorship for you guys. Uh, we do have a new partnership, of course, Asus Boom, Asus Audio. You can follow their Instagram, actually. Uh, what you guys can do is go to our website. Of course, our website is in our link description below. You'll see the tab of KLP eStore. Click on that eStore and you get uh, 60% off the next headphone apparel, whether it's headphones or earphones. 
All you have to do is enter the prompt, enter your information, and also enter our promo code to be eligible for that 60% discount on your next order. So I really recommend you guys go get it. We do have a pair of headphones from Asus Audio, Asus Boom, and we're really rocking them right now with this podcast, and we're loving it. So I really recommend you guys doing that thing out there for you, all right? So that's going to do it for the Grizzly Top Podcast, Podcast Thursday's episode. Man, the excitement is really real. You know, I just, I'm really amazing, you know, nostalgia here in Grizzly Digital Network Media Room. So that's going to do it for the Grizzly Talk Podcast with your host, Kennedy Patterson. We'll hear you guys in the next podcast. Go Grizzlies. Grizzlies.